Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A12 and today I'll show you how to hard reset the device through recovery mode. Now this process will also remove a screen lock if you have one that you might not know the combination to. As you can see I do have one set and I'm gonna progress with this process uh, as though I don't actually know it. So to get started we will need to forcibly shut off the device um, as you will probably be aware if you try to turn it off normally like this uh, that won't work. Uh, draw a pattern to turn off phone. So what we need to do is basically hold the power key and volume down. You're gonna hold it and the device will turn off. It will turn back on. You will see a Samsung Galaxy writing on the screen. You will keep holding it. The logo will disappear. And once it disappears, you're gonna switch to holding volume up. So power key volume up. And this will then take us to the recovery mode. Now, this is the only way you can actually access the recovery mode. You do need to hold it for longer than ever before. So let's get straight to it. Now I'm gonna light up the screen so I can see. Actually, it doesn't really matter if I see when it turns off. So yeah, let's just start off. Power key, volume down. So as you've seen, the de device is right now completely locked and I'm not inputting any kind of protection. Now there's the Galaxy, keep holding. It should disappear right about now. There we go. So let's switch to volume up. It turns back on. And this will take us to recovery mode in a second. There we go. So as you see this on the screen, you can let go. So from the recovery mode, you want to scroll down using volume keys. So let's navigate down to wipe data, factory reset, and then confirm it with power key. And again, let's select factory data reset, confirm it, and data wipe complete. And reboot system now selected by default. So press power key once more and the device will now reboot. Now it will be turning on for a little bit longer than it normally does, uh, probably like five to 10 minutes longer. Um, that is because the process of resetting the device is being done in the background, even though you can't see anything on the screen, it is being basically performed in the background. So that's why it's taking it longer. But anyway, once it's finished, uh, we should then be presented with the Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that's actually visible. And as you can see now, the process is almost finished. Any moment now. Oh, there we go. So from here, you can set up your device as however you like. Uh, so if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.